For ACUSports.com, I'm Grant Boone here with Julie Goodenough after the women's team fell at Texas Tech this morning, 61-44. to It's just been a few minutes after the game. What stands out? Uh, we just didn't get it done on the, the rebounding side of the ball. Uh, we knew coming in that uh, we were going to have to be really physical and block out and rebound, and we just didn't do it. We didn't get that done. And uh, defensively, I don't have that many complaints about our defense. I mean, we, we forced uh, the Lady Raiders into uh, running their offense deep into the shot clock over and over and over. Um, and when you do that, then you've got to finish with contest and shot, blocking out and rebounding. We just didn't do that. Uh, so now you go home. You have a, a little bit of a break. This will be the biggest break you have for the rest of the year. What do you plan to do during that time besides uh, we, finals? Yeah, we're, we're going to do awesome next week in finals. We're going to allot some time for studying, but uh, it, it allows us some time to really focus on ourselves. We'll get a lot of individual skill work in um, and just you know focus on ourselves for a while instead of worrying about the next opponent. So it's a good time of the year where you can kind of evaluate what you've done early on in your non-conference games and make some changes, make some adjustments. So we're looking forward to that time that they, we can just spend on ourselves. Sure, they had the school kids here. You'll have the school kids there December 15th, right? Absolutely. December 15th, all elementary schools, staff, uh, students, staff, all personnel will get in free to our December 15th games. So we're looking forward to that. And that's a Monday night. ACU back home at Moody Coliseum to take on Southwestern Christian. For Julie Goodenough, I'm Grant Boone for ACUsports.com.